Maka be babes, this is your teacher babes and welcome to Mom Babes TV where you can learn mathematics in just watching videos. So, like, comment, and share and also don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell para updated kayo sa mga latest na videos. Enjoy learning while watching. Love, love, love. Mwah! Okay, so for today's topic, we will discuss about the least common multiple of 2 to 3 numbers using factor 3. So, when we say the least common multiple or the LCM, it is the product of all divisors and the numbers in the final row. You can use listing method, factor 3, and continuous division. Okay, so... Let's have examples on finding the least common multiple or LCM of 2 to 3 numbers using the factor 3. So, let's have example number 1. So, in example number 1, we, need, we will find the least common multiple of 8 and 14. Okay, so the first thing that we need to do is to find the prime factors of 8 and 14. So, let's start with the number Eight. So, 8 has a factor of 2 and 4. And 4 has a prime factors of 2 times 2. So, the prime factors of 8 is 2 times 2 times 2. And then, next is 14. So, the prime factors of 14 is 2 times 7. So, alam naman natin na ang 2 at saka ang 7 is already a prime numbers. So, pag sinabi ang prime numbers, ang factor lang niya is ang kanyang sarili at saka si 1. So, 2 times 1 is 2 at saka 7 times 1 is 7. Wala ng ibang factors ang 7 maliban sa kanyang sarili at saka si 1. Ganun din si 2. Okay, next. We need to list all the prime factors of 8 and 14. So, sa 8, meron tayong 2 times 2 times 2. At saka sa 14 naman, meron tayong 2 times 7. Okay, so, alam naman natin, sinabi ko kanina, ang meaning ng LCM, or the least common multiple, is the product of all divisors and the numbers in a final row. Okay, so, ang final row ng 8 and 14 is 2 times 2 times 2 times 7. Bakit nag naging ganyan? So, Itong dalawa, since ang 8 at saka 14, merong prime factors na 2, counted lang siya as 1. And then, next is, meron pang 2 at saka 2 at saka last si 7. So, ang LCM ng 8 and 14 is 2 times 2 times 2 times 7. So, 2 times 2 is 4 times 2 is 8. And then, 8 times 7 is 15. Six. Okay, so this common multiple of 8 and 14 is 56. Okay, since tapos na tayo kumuha ng LCM ng dalawang numbers, pumunta naman tayo sa tatlong numbers. So, let's have example number 2. So, we will find the LCM of 3 numbers. So, LCM of 8, 14, and 10. Okay, again, we will find the prime factors of each number. So, first, let's find the prime factors of 8. So, sabi ko kanina sa example number 1, ang factors ng 8 ay 2 times 4 and then si 4 meron pa siyang prime factors na 2 times 2. So, ang prime factors ng 8 ay 2 times 2 times 2. Next, 14, meron tayong 2 times 7. Okay, next, 10. So, ang prime factors ng 10 ay 2 times 5. Okay, so, ang 2 is already a prime number at saka ganun din si 5. Wala nang ibang factors si 5 at saka si 2. Kaya, prime numbers sila. Next, ilista na natin ang lahat ng kanilang mga prime factors. So, 8, 14 at saka 10. So, ang prime factors ng 8 ay 2 times 2 times 2. So, meron tayong 2 times 2 times 2. At saka, ang factor ni 14, meron tayong 2 times 7. At saka, last, si 10, meron tayong 2 times 
5. Okay, so ilista na natin ang lahat ng divisors nila. So, ito, since meron silang pare-parehong 2, counted as 1 lang siya. So, 2 times 2 times 2 times 7 at saka times 5. So, imamultiply lang na, imamultiply natin itong lahat. Saka natin mahanap ang LCM ng 8, 14 at saka 10. Ulitin ko, LCM stand for least common multiple. So, meron tayong 2 times 2 times 2 times 7 times 5. So, ang answer niya is 280. Okay, 2 times 2 is 4 times 2 is 8. 8 times 7 is 56. 56 times 5 is 280. So, this is now the least common multiple of 8, 14, at saka 10. Okay, let's have another example, which is example number 3. So, we will going to find the least common multiple of 12 and 15. Okay, so first, kailangan muna natin hanapin ang prime factors ng 12 at saka 15 using the factor 3. Let's start with 12. 12, pero siyang factor na 3 at saka 4. Ang 3 is already a prime number, kaya okay na siya. So, si 4, meron pa siyang factor na 2 times 2. Okay, so ang Ang prime factors ni 12 is 3 times 2 times 2. 3 times 2 is 6 times 2 is 12. Next, we will need to find the prime factor of 15 using the uh, factor 3. Okay, so ang 15 meron lang siyang uh, prime factors na 3 and 5. Kasi ang numbers na 3 and 5 is already the prime number. Okay. Next is, kailangan natin ilista ang mga factors ng 12 at saka 15. So, ang prime factors ng 12 is 3 times 2 times 2. 3 times 2 is 6 times 2 is 12. Next, 3 times 5. Okay, so ilista na natin lahat ang kanilang mga Factor. So, since parang silang parehas na 3, counted lang siya as 1. So, 3, next, times 2, times 2, and then last is times 5. So, we will therefore conclude that the least common multiple of 12 and 15 is 3 times 2, 6, times 2 is 12, times 5 is 60. So, ang LCM or ang least common multiple ng 12 and 15 is 60. Since tapos na ako, magbigay ng tatlong examples on how to find the least common multiple of 2 numbers at saka 3 numbers. Ngayon naman, kayo na ang maghahanap ng LCM. Okay, so now, it's your turn. Okay, so, ang hahanapin lang naman ninyo is to find the LCM of 24, 12, and 15. Okay, so, kapag nahanap na, na ninyo ang LCM ng 24, 12, and 15, you can comment down below. And then, kapag tama ang inyong sagot, shout out po kayo sa aking susunod na video. So, Enjoy solving! So, that's all for the discussion of today's topic. Sana may natutunan kayo sa mga tinuro ko. At kung alam mo ang sagot sa tanong ko, mag-comment lang sa ating comment section at pagtamang iyong sagot, isa-shout out kita sa mga susunod kong videos. Also, mag-comment din kayo kung ano ang gusto nyong discuss na topic na related sa mathematics. So, that's all 
for today. Don't forget to like, comment, and share, and hit the bell button para updated kayo sa mga latest na videos. See you in my next vlog. Love, love, love. Mwah!